Hey everyone, Katherine King here, ready for another installment of What Did I Haul? All right, so today I have actually a few videos for you, but the first one I'm very excited about. So this is someone I recently found, I'm just gonna rip it open, came in just a little mailer like this. I didn't order a whole lot, but it's SEMO Wax, S-E-M-O Wax. Um, I have fallen in love with her aesthetic um, and her wax, and you'll see why here in a minute. She's always amazing at double bagging. I did have my husband fetch these out of the mailbox for me because we're only 90 today, but uh, it's supposed to be bloody hot this weekend. Um, so as you know, I live in Oregon and we usually see 80 to 90 degree weather during the summer. June is usually 70s, 80s, right? We usually don't actually hit summer. We, we call it, we don't get summer until July 5th. It's kind of like just a running joke around Oregon is summer doesn't start till July 5th. Well, this weekend is supposed to be 110 and 108. So yeah, not very happy about that. Um, I work for a lumber mill and so we have our forklift drivers out loading lumber on trucks all day. I don't happen to have um, a fan in my, or a air conditioner in my office, I just have a fan, but I'm lucky that there are air conditioners in the building, but you know, I'm in a shipping office. I'm not in a main office with regular air conditioning. So <sighs> I know I'm bitching and moaning, but we're also remodeling our bathroom, which is a separate building. So we're in an outhouse. So it's it's been a long week. It's Friday. I'm so thankful it's Friday. So let's get into some really awesome wax. So Simo, she sends a little card like this and she always writes thank you. And it's handwritten. That, I love the fact that that's handwritten and so many of the vendors that I buy from write, hand write on theirs, whether it's their packers or, you know, the poorer themselves. The fact that they write, handwrite on them, I love that about them. It's very personal. So these are the waxes that I get. I tip, these are the ones that I typically like to get. Have I gotten other ones? Yes. Um, oh, obviously I have zucchini in the bunch. Smells so good. Throw my trash down there. Um, anyway, and uh, because I like these because they're just very easy to cut. I bought ones that were like little, they look like little melting pots. They were the cutest. Um, they kind of crumble. So I, I happen to really like this style plus in my bins. So back here, this is all Scentsy. Um, there is no vendor wax in here at all. This is all Scentsy. This, this whole display is Scentsy. Um, so I have other um, places that I store my wax in large bins under my bed. Um, so this stores really, really well. So depending upon what your guys' storage, you know, um, process is, these store really well and I like that. All right, so let's get into this. The sample she sent, she does put on here the pour date and it, um, it is absolute, absolutely fabulous coffee cake. I thought I ordered that. No, good, I didn't. Oh, that's good. Oh, this is one of those. She has these ones. I don't know what they're called, but like they're in this little rainbow shape. This is really nice because um, you definitely get the coffee. That is really, really good. And you know, I like smelling in the bag because I seem to get a better smell. Yeah, I don't smell it as well doing it that way. This is really good. It's like, you know, that nice rich cake, um, kind of like a coffee cake with that coffee flavor or scent. Very, very nice. Okay. So surprise, surprise to zucchini bread supreme. So I just, I had to try it. All right. Oh, I wish I, does she write scent notes? She does send the receipt, which is really nice. Okay, it doesn't say, and I'm still filming on my phone until we get Starlink. This is kind of what we're gonna have to be doing for now. So let's hope we get Starlink soon so we can actually have internet out here in the country. 
um, that's a lot better than what we have. Could you imagine only having 35, what is it? Kilobytes, megabytes, gigs, whatever it is of, of data before your usage drops? Sucks. When I lived in town, it was so much better. But I prefer my Christmas trees. This is really, really good. So I think she said this is like the ultimate zucchini bread. And it is very nice. Um, this was poured on 525. So that's about a month ago. So that's actually really good. I might pop some of this in tonight. Beautiful, rich, lovely zucchini bread. I'm going to wait on that one. All right. This next one is cappuccino ex uh, espresso cookie dough. Okay, I smell the cappuccino. So the cappuccino seems to have a little bit different of a smell versus just espresso. Because it's almost like you can smell that foam or something. I know a latte has foam, but it has a little bit of uh, different richness. And this has the cookie dough in it. That is really good. And I have a large quantity of coffee. I really need to stop ordering coffee blends because um, I've kind of run out of space. That is really, really good. And, I mean, seriously, aren't these just so cute? I love them. All right, next one. Raspberry cheesecake bites. So sometimes cheesecake can smell a bit sour. So one of the ones back here, blueberry cheesecake, oh gosh, kitty hair, can smell a bit sour. I have two cats in here today. Mm, it no no sourness at all. It's just a beautiful raspberry creaminess that I smell. AJ's back there being obnoxious. That is really really nice, and I can see myself mixing this like with the zucchini bread, and like making it like even more rich. That's what I like. That's what I like about zucchini bread, is the richness that it is. Hi, AJ. What's up? You wanna come over here? Here, let me move those for you. You gonna come over here, sit down? There's AJ. He looks eyeballs. Mwah. Okay, next one, oh, you wanna sniff it? The next one is lemon cookie bars. AJ. You're going to say hi, AJ. All right. So lemon cookie bars. Can I smell it? What do you see? It's, um, it's not like a, let me move this, get his ears out of the way. It's not like a really strong lemon. It's more like a creamy lemon mixed with cookie dough is what it smells like to me. So you know how sometimes you'll get those like really strong, just pow, lemon. This isn't one of those. This is a creamy lemon and cookie. And it's very, very good. And all these were poured around 521, 522, except for this last one, which I already have one of these. Um, so these are, a, I usually let things cure about a month. So these are about ready. And this last one I got is Downtown Bakery. And I do have another one of these. Wanna smell it? What are you seeing? Zucchini bread. Zucchini bread. It smells like zucchini bread and the cookie dough and bread, bread. And that is so good. Hi, huh, it's a. <laughs> anyway, it's really good. If you're looking for maybe a little bit milder, uh, if you want to like say, try your hand at cookie dough, or I mean, uh, zucchini bread, and you want to go a little milder, this might be the way to go uh, because it is a milder zucchini bread because you get that other bakery dough yumminess in it. So, so that is all I got from Simo. I, you know, I saw that she had restocked these. I like these, they're easy. Um, I just cut it in half. 
Um, so for me, if, if a pack of six is 12 melts. So I'm really excited about that. So uh, yeah, that's all I got for you today. Uh, I think it was, you know, a really good haul. I love everything here. I guess I don't normally step out of my comfort zone. I am Fruity Bakery. Um, other things will give me a headache, so I don't try those, those other aesthetics. So Fruity Bakery, coffee. So anyway, thanks for hanging out with me, and I will see you in my next video along with AJ. Bye.